welcome to Lavanya's computer classes. In this video, I will explain old question paper JNTH R18 Database Management System CSE second year second sem. This is also November 2020 Corona pattern. In the previous video, already I kept one video like uh, Database Management System paper analysis March 2022 paper. This is November 2020 paper. This is also Corona pattern. Here also same thing answer any five questions. Uh, out of 8, maximum marks is 75. So, here first question is, what is DBMS? List 4 significant differences between file processing system and a DBMS. It is very very important question. Already I kept one video that is oh, DBMS important questions, unit wise important question. In that I already specifically mentioned, this is very important question. Either they are asking individually. Uh, disadvantage of file processing or advantage of DBMS are directly they are asking like this. So, this is 6 marks question and B bit is what is ER model? Draw an ER diagram for any banking enterprise system. The, for this question also already I kept one video. Check it that video also otherwise I will keep it in the description box. Mm, description. So, how to draw an ER diagram for bank, banking enterprise system? 9 marks question this is. So, first question is totally from unit 1. I will give the paper unit wise analysis also. First see the questions. Then 2a. Explain about outer join operation in relational algebra. In so many times I said in the first unit um, there are uh, not first unit second unit there are three concepts are there. One is the domain relational calculus, tuple relational calculus and relational algebra. From these three topics compulsory questions are came. So, what are the topics means? One is the relational algebra. Remember these topics. Don't forget these topics. How to read these concepts. Relational algebra, tuple relational calculus, then domain relational calculus. From these three compulsory at least two or minimum compulsory one is compulsory. So, read these three topics from unit two. So, here the question is. Explain about outer join operation in relational algebra. 7 marks. And B bit is explain about domain relational calculus with example. Now, what I said, relational algebra, domain relational calculus, tuple relational calculus are very, very important concepts in unit 2. Next, unit, uh, question number 3. Explain the following operators in SQL with examples. First operator is sum. Second one is in. Third one is accept. Fourth one is exists. Yesterday only I done one video that is exists and not exists. So they are asking individually. So explain all these four. What is the use of these comments? What is the syntax? And take any one example. Eight marks question. Four questions are there. Four bits are there. Four into two. Eight marks. And very very important question. Common question is explain various DML functions. In SQL with examples, DML commands, DDL commands are very, very important. Basic fundamental question. Next, sixth, fourth question is explain shadow paging recovery scheme for recovering the database. Shadow paging algorithm, shadow paging recovery method. Direct question, 15 marks question. Next, explain deletion and insertion operations in linear hashing with example. This is from unit 5 direct question, 15 marks question. Sixth A is explain about various database users and administrators in DBMS. What type of database users are there? System analysts, programmers, database users, end users, uh, testing. So many are there. We just write any uh, all the ex members. Next, draw an ER diagram for weak entity set and strong entity set with example. Definition of weak entity, definition of strong entity. And also take one example for how to draw ER diagram. Seventh question is explain modifications of the database operations in relational algebra with example. Again question from relational algebra. And B bit is explain about domain relational calculus with example. If you observe in this paper 2B explain about domain relational calculus and 7B also same question is repeated. If the question is coming like this attempt in two times, you get the marks in two times also. Next eighth question is very, very, very important question DBMS. That is what is normalization? Explain 4NF and 5NF normal forms with example. 
already in the previous video uh, that is November uh, March 2022 already said normal forms are very important in the normal forms in that paper they are asking 1 nf, 2 nf, 3 nf so 1 to 5 nf so read very carefully first normal form, second normal form, third, fourth and fifth and also BCNF without reading these questions relational algebra, TRC, tuple relational calculus, domain relational calculus, normal forms and dead luck for this I um, prepare one more video separately these are very very important questions in DBMS now we will go for unit wise unit wise analysis see here this is the first question what is the first question DBMS difference between file system and uh, database management system that is from unit 1 next one is ER model draw an ER model for bank enterprise that is also unit 1 so from unit 1 uh, first question anyway that is A and B bits both are in from unit 1 next second bit is second question is 2A outer join operation in relational algebra that is from unit 2 domain relational calculus that is also from unit 2 next third question is explain SQL operator sum in except exists from unit 3 explain DML commands that is also unit 3 unit 4 direct question shadow pacing recovery method that is from unit 4 and your question 5 is insertion and deletion operation linear hashing that is from unit 5 and sixth question again questions are repeated database users and administrator from unit 1 and to draw ER diagram for weak and strong entity that is also from unit 1 seventh question modifications in relational algebra unit 2 and again same question is repeated DRC that is from unit 2 and last question eighth question is normalization explain about 4NF and 3NF from unit 3 so these are the questions now I will give the weightage from unit 1 there are which questions are came from means question number 1 and 6 question number 1 and 6 came from unit 1 that means 2 questions from unit 1 next from unit 2 question number 2 and question number 7 in this question paper so again 2 questions are came from unit 2 from unit 3 question number 3 and question number 8 both are belongs to unit 3 the, so two unit two, uh, two questions are came from unit 3 from unit 4 only one question came that is question number 4 so unit 4 is from only one unit 5 is also only one question came that is linear hashing linear hashing insertion and deletion operation so out of five units from unit 1 two questions from unit 2 two questions from unit 3 2 unit 4 and unit 5 only one one questions are came totally eight question so this is the paper analysis for November 2020 and previously already I explained gave the demo analysis for March 2022 now it is the November 2020 so check all these videos analysis and concentrate which units are very important so because it is a corona pattern read only some three and a half units and pass the paper without any, keep any backlogs thank you for watching my video if you like this video please subscribe my channel share it to your friends thank you